Good morning, James Morrison, J Social Cycling. Got in the wrong gear. How did I do that? Look at the weather. Looking gorgeous out here. Looking gorgeous out here. It is bloody freezing. It is so cold, people. So cold. Ah. <laughs> uh, hope you lovely people are all well. Look side lights on and bloody fog hope you're all well people sorry I haven't been about uh, yeah it was busy last weekend um, with the parents down so my apologies on that I've got Neil somewhere behind me we are wearing the new James Social Cycling winter kit <laughs> I went for the Right, hold on. Went for the winter, wintry blue. Anyway. Anyway, just a bit of an intro. Got a 20 mile James Social Cycling. Uh, social ride this morning. Mad as hatters as a, you probably would gather. I think mean, this is the coldest coldest morning out I have to say so let's wait for Neil we can say hello you all right yeah I've knocked the mud guard in the, uh, in the car hey I've knocked, I've knocked the mud guard in the car oh was all right now Alright mate, as long as you're alright. Yeah. Getting on the main road, so I will catch you all later. guys, 10 of us out this morning, nice lovely little group, a couple of newbies, uh, who we got, so we've got Stephen on his classic, we've got Leslie, Richard, there's Bryony, newbie Bryony, Moira, newbie, and then we've got Tracy, Trish, uh, Neil and Andy, so yeah, nice little group out this morning so and it's a bit chilly but you can see behind me the blue skies are looking good morning are looking good I can't film behind you because you're showing your cracks Steve it's no good for it's no good for film <laughs> so some of you know I've uh, decided to give up the flab social rides um, Chris Shackleton, I've handed the gauntlet over to him. So, hopefully my guys and all the group will support him in his quest. And thanks to Chris for taking over. Uh, obviously, that doesn't mean I'm stopping doing the rides. There's plenty of room around here for, for more groups. So, uh, yeah, so he's, um, he will be on Let's Ride. And you'll probably notice if you are with the Flab Hampshire group on Let's Ride, you'll notice that he's now uh, the owner of the group. So, sorry, it's a bit hairy going down this bit of road. So yeah, so thanks to Chris. Obviously we needed somebody to take the helm. Um, I'm doing a couple of 
I'm still going to do my regular, still going to do my beginner, and then I am. Do you want me to go through first? Take some real bikes to go down there. Take the camera, Jen. Hey. Alright, so you can see the group have all wetted out. If you stay down the middle and hold on to the bars. <laughs> Proper bikes just right behind you. Excellent. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, we're coming up to some hills now, so I am going to put you back in the pocket and I'll catch up with you in a bit. Going left, Steve, you keep going, mate. I'll catch you up on the hill, alright? Yeah, <laughs> it's all clear, guys. Right, See? Your bike clean, but that's yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Meet you at the top. Me at the top. Slow guys, slow down. If you can stop. I don't know where he's going. Right, sorry guys, keep going, keep going, it's fine. Clear. Thank you. You're right, mate. Come back! Ah oh, man. Go back still. Wrong time to get the camera out. Wrong time to get the camera out guys. It's to try and overtake us on a bend. Blind road. I get too close to Leslie to get me dirty. <laughs> I've been safe, safe than sorry. Yeah, the sun's over that way. We're going back towards Sherfield and Bramley. That says it all. It's coming through Silchester. Got some of the ladies' footies. Girls for Easter, Christmas trees going up. Ours is going up the weekend. Christmas trees going up the weekend. It's coming. We got a car back. Morning. Look at that! What a view! James Morrison, James Social Cycling. How are we doing? Sunday. 23 miles in. Battling up. We come from all the way down there, didn't we Trace? All the way. All the way down there. We're nearly at the top. Uh, JSC Long Ride Group. First ride out today, but I didn't really finish yesterday's vlog, so I thought I'd add it to today. Hope you are all well. The group are waiting for us at the top. Just making sure Tracy don't bugger off. 
<laughs> and the group are waiting. That's a lovely climb, but I expect everybody to hate me for it. How was that, guys? Ouch! Really? <laughs> Ouch! <laughs> it's so weird because when you look, you look like you're flat. Yes. <laughs> no, it's not. Hold you. Elbows in, head down. Yeah. And then you get this, look. Yeah, beautiful. I was thinking this would be a lovely route to down the motorway. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's beautiful out here. You just yeah. get to sit on the back and admire the view. <laughs> yeah, lazily. Nice Sunday ride. Excellent. Car up. I think we've. To be fair, I think we've only got about three miles to Odium, so. So we get coffee and refreshments are uh, a must, I would say. Oh. Only right turn down here, but and beautiful views, guys. Beautiful views, absolutely gorgeous, but freezing. We've got a funny left turn coming up, so I'm not going to be good with you in my hands. I hope you are all well, my apologies. I couldn't even finish yesterday's vlog. Today has been hard work, just getting the bloody thing out of my pocket, so my apologies. My apologies, but look at this. Alright, we're going left. Mind the, mind the road surface. It's very clear. Mind the road surface. <laughs> Neil and Amanda. <laughs> we lost Neil again. And some views and a bit of climbing to do. Little picture for Anne. Nice little walky bit she used to go up to. That's uh, up in Wells. Hi guys and girls. Nice little group on my first long ride. Of, uh, 25 miles in one puncher not me Amy uh, so nice and fixed and uh, we're probably about a mile or so away from Odium Fountain Cafe stop so looking forward to that very hungry very hungry 
How you doing, all right? Oh yeah, I know, it's been a long, innit? it? It's been a bit long. We'll see you, Mike. Cut the journey a bit quicker on the way home. So, Car up! So I started the turbo trainer this week, last week, and found out that my right leg is still not doing very well. So kind of using the trainer to give that a bit of a boost to be honest I found that it was actually only doing about 20% of the work I knew it was quite weak but I wasn't pretty sure on how bad but the turbo has obviously shown that it is pretty weak and uh, bloody hell and it hard work on the turbo Very hard work, look at this. Hi guys. Not far to the cafe now. Cafe stop, oh so close. Are you singing? La 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 la. <laughs> it was only a small incline. Don't make it out as a, I'm better than I am. <laughs> Beautiful people. <laughs> I don't even know what I look like under that. I look a mess, that's what I look. Uh, yeah, sorry I didn't bring any more out on the ride. My apologies. Um, it was all a bit, a bit busy. Some of the lanes around there are a little bit dodgy. And being that they were all wet, well, what do you expect? And look, coffee. You are lich. It's a hair. Anyway, just cleaning the bike. So we're just back. Did. 49 miles I think with the 1.7 mile there and back um, and about 47 miles on that side of it um, so yeah so hope you're all well I think that's been there all bloody time hope you're all well and um, just cleaning the bike off after that ride after yesterday's and then today's ride and uh, I was going to chat to you about a couple of things actually it was a bit on the angle I suppose <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to chat to you a couple of things. Um, I said actually out on the ride, I started on the turbo trainer. I've got an Elite Fluid, so it's not a, a smart trainer or anything because I've had that for quite a while. It's just about pedaling them with the gears. And um, yeah, just been following a CTX sort of um, Aussie channel that they do some rides um, on the bike gang and uh, train gang. and you just put the efforts in so that's all I'm doing at the moment is pushing myself which is good um, done that all this week so I've done about four or five I think it's about four rides indoors so anything from 25 minutes up to 35 minutes so not much but my god it kills me it kills me but the other good thing was was I was gonna say my right leg and if you know some of you know that I snapped my cruciate ligament January 2017 um, and I have to say is getting on the trainer has uh, shown me that actually it's still as weak as hell I found myself after the first five minutes 
my um, left leg was killing me because I was my right leg weren't doing any work at all. So uh, yeah, so kind of consciously been trying to sort of make the right leg do some work, which is um, hopefully going to work. I'll, I'll find out. It felt a bit stronger. There was a, a little hill today, and I thought to myself, my left leg was tired, but actually I had some energy in the right leg. So consciously, I'm doing it. I'm, I'm basically pedalling with the bloody left leg most of the time when I'm out on the road. So, uh, so yeah, so it's a bit of a pain, really. But anyway, anyway, so that gives me something to think about over the winter course. What else is there? Yeah, I told you about the flab, so giving up the flab. I don't know how much I said about that it was yesterday, but um, handed that over to Chris because he showed some interest and did a couple of rides for me. I may be repeating myself. Did a couple of rides for me when I had a bad back, um, showed some interest on in wanting to do his own rides. I noticed he did a, a couple of, he did one social ride down his way. And I just thought with my calendar getting quite busy with JSC, and things I thought I'd just hand it over to him see if he was interested he was interested and yeah so um, good luck to him and hopefully hopefully all my um, members will show him a bit of support I know you will um, hopefully it's uh, well hopefully he'll be able to generate some some more people down his way because he um, lives down Oakley way so the other side of Basingstoke so it might actually generate a bit a bit more down that way so it'd be, be good for him and and James Social Cycling or James Social Rides can carry on up this way, which would be good. Done some, as I said today, did a James Social long ride. So I've got a, a, a very select few, just a few people where we can sort of go out and do 40 to 50 miles. We did 46 miles today um, without any dramas. I say without any dramas, I don't mean it in that way. It's just obviously it means that I can do a longer ride and I get to bring some people along with me as well. So it's been good. We had a puncher today, which was <laughs> which was good. It was a bit of an eye opener for some, but um, anyway, these things happen. You know, these things do happen. I'm trying to stay warm out here. It's bloody freezing. Um, so yeah, so. So giving up the flab, started the turbo, even if it isn't on a smart train, I'm not spending out. I appreciate it, but what seven to a thousand quid no nah. no nah, i'd rather just keep me fluid train elite fluid it's good it's not too bad use the gears and to be honest ruby's on it so and she hasn't made any noise which i can't believe i cannot believe anyway anyway so what else was i going to chat to you about i'm going to keep this short and sweet um yeah i think that was it really what else was it I don't know. I think that was it. I've had a bit of, little bit of low moments of uh, last few few weeks, but nothing too heavy. It's been all right. Quite looking forward to my three weeks off at Christmas. Um, hoping to bring some, uh, hoping to do a few rides. I uh, didn't even set. I didn't set myself a target this year for miles. But last year I did 2,254 miles, um, um, and so far this year I've probably just done 4,002 just under 2 4,200 just under so I've kind of set myself a target of doing four and a half so I've got a little bit to do over December so to try I've got 300 miles to do over December so um, yeah fingers crossed I'll get that all done so be all right all cool Nothing else really to report really. The future of James Social Cycling, as I said, I've got the James Social Cycling long rides. I'm still doing my regular rides, still doing my beginner rides. Hopefully be able to branch out for a bit more of that, talking to um, somebody Christmas Eve from the council. So I'm hoping that we can try and support something a bit different there as well. Um, yeah, so hopefully bring some more news to you on that later on, basically. Apologies again for not doing any videos the last couple of weeks, I think. It'll be the last couple of weekends, but um, yeah. I've just <clears throat> Whether I not felt it or I was too busy, it was difficult enough the last couple of days, to be fair. So really, really sorry about that. Really sorry about that. 
and my 200 has gone up to 243 I think up until today so welcome to all my wonderful new subscribers and thank you to all my regulars um, hopefully I can there's a couple of reviews I want to do from some gear that I've got um, well, thanks for that much appreciated everybody hopefully I can bring you some more vids over the Christmas period um, Work's well, going to be busy next year, um, whether that's a good thing or not. Um, but I've got three weeks to chill over Christmas. Three weeks. On the 13th of December. I can't wait. I'm quite looking forward to it. But anyway, well done, guys. Hopefully, lots of love. And hopefully, see you on the road very soon.